Is that a bear? Oh no. Oh shit. I do have a sword attached to my shield, yeah. <laughs> Here, hold on. I'm just gonna... A room bear! No! <laughs> no! No! many shrines as possible. Get my health and stamina up. Rise and fall. Okay.
that's weird. Is it not? glider I can't do it without the glider damn I know how to do it but I can't do it without the glider oh. that sucks at least I know I don't know what to do to get the glider that's okay probably just have to do more of the story I do need to go to the bathroom now. Just give me a sec. I'll be right back. Oh! Sorry, I also decided to grab food while I was over there. So now I have food! I made shepherd's pie for dinner. It's really good. Yeah, so I'll be nibbling on this while I play. The store had like a mixture of pork and beef, like ground pork and beef. So I got that because I thought that's neat. And um, then there's also fried onions. Uh, I used lorries with cooking the meat. And then a bunch of corn. And then in the mashed potatoes, I used this like fancy um, butter, like a uh, like grass fed butter. Bridges, I am going to fucking drown you. All right. I'm gonna drown you. Okay? I fucking hate the Shepherd's Pie Cottage Pie discourse. Everybody knows what I'm talking about. Fuck you. <laughs> um. <laughs> and so the, the mashed potatoes have garlic, no, no, salt and pepper and ginger. And then I use five year old aged cheddar cheese. And then I put garlic on top of that uh, with like fresh uh, peppercorn and stuff. Yeah, 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 I know. It's not lamb. Get off there. Uh, pie crust layer of meat, but... Oh, okay. Oh, what's going on over here? This is really cute. I like that. Oh, so fellow traveler, what are you searching for on your journey? My passion is finding geoglyphs. They're enormous pictures that have been drawn on the ground. Oh, when they were when they were drawn, and by who and how, the mysteries abound. I hear there's a geoglyph near the Thylo- the Thyflo ruins, which are north of here, past the Elden Mountains. Mm. Now that Death Mountain has stopped erupting, one can travel there freely. Though that's not, uh, to say crossing the nearby mountain is an easy task. Yeah, I probably need more stamina, to be totally honest. Hmm, <laughs> the Dal and Drab Woodlands Stable Route, or the Red Hot- Hill stable route. What? Hey. Oh, it's finally nodding off. Uh, what is it? You want to know what it means to be red hot? Mm. So a while back, Death Mountain was super active. We're talking full force, non-stop red hot lava. But now the lava's all cooled down and hardened into a new road. It's uh, super easily walkable. Huh. And there's nothing red hot about easily walkable. Now on the other hand, the route going up to Death Mountain from Foothill Stable... Well, there's an old dangerous road absolutely crawling with monsters. If you're looking for red hot, that's where to find it. Thing is, my muscles aren't exactly ready to take the heat, so that makes my decision more complicated. Look, 
it takes sleep to burn so bright. So will you let me recharge a bit? Well, now I, I feel like I gotta pick up a bunch of rocks. Who's over here? Are you a friend or a foe? Business in this cave? By any chance? I'm sorry to say, but right now it's, uh. Ah! Big Brother! <laughs> it's no use! <laughs> Colton! Please, it's impossible! Absurd, even, to try to turn yourself into a legendary creature. A Satori, no less. Absurd. Hmm. You should be working on the monster collection with me instead of chasing a silly dream like that. Yeah! <laughs> I will never give up, Colton. I have always wanted to be a Satori. I will be a Satori. I do not care what it takes. All I need is to get my fingers on a Moogle gem. Then I'm sure to turn, it, to turn into a Satori. Huh. The rumors are true. There's a creature in the cave called the Booble Frog, and it glows just like a Satori. Uh, well, I didn't think it'd be so high up on the wall to run about all nimbly bimbly like that. Hmm. In that case, little brother, why not get some help to catch you a Booble Frog? Yes. Yes. Do you remember all that treasure you collected? You could offer that in a trade. Or your ears? Your ears will be fine. Ah, Traveler, do you hear me and my brother talking? Mm. If I'm gonna make my dream come true, I must get my fingers on a booble gem. Mm. Ah, but the booble frog is so nimbly wimbly and hard to catch. <laughs> you want to hear about my dream? Ah, Well, it's simple, really. I dream of becoming a Satori. You know, the creature of myth. Satori are legendary creatures that have been spotted all over Hyrule. Piercing eyes, bluish white fur. Oh, how I've admired them since I was a wee Colton. <laughs> and then I read these ancient texts and they told me how to transform myself. Which to transform me, Colton, into a Satori. Uh -huh. For it to work, I must find a booble frog, a strange creature that lives dark in dark caves. And glows a bluish white like a Satori. And then I have to collect a booble gem, which is a bobble that bubble frogs drop when they're feeling weak. That's why I chased after the booble frog lurking in the cave. I wanted to get my fingers on ah. that gem. But who knew booble frogs could, gum could gamble about like that? So nimbly bimbly. Ah. I want to be a Satori. I will be a Satori. Whatever it takes. Ah. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> but that is my wish and my dream and my reason for doing such things. So if you get a hold of a booble gem, Please, give it to me. I'll give you a treasure and trade, I swear. Ah, oh, that's a booble gem. Mm. Colton, is it the real thing? Mm. That perfect shape in the faint blue glow. <laughs> it's a real booble gem. Real as can be. Ah. You did it. Now I can transform into a Satori, just like the ones I adore. Thank you so much. Please take this gifty in return. <laughs> oh, hell yeah. Oh, yeah. Ah. See, I collect all sorts of monstrous treasures. That is, monster parts and goods that make you look like a monster. The mask I gave you was to make me look... Oh, hi. <laughs> Hello, thing. You just want my pie. The mask I gave you was made to look just like a bubble... A, bo a bokoblin. So much that it even a bokoblin uh, would take you for one. 
By all means, do try it on. Then you'll see what it's like to have a body in the heart of a Bokoblin. And at last, the time has come. Time to gobble down the bubble jam. Cheers and bottoms up! <laughs> oh, my body! It isn't changing, but... But I do feel a strange sensation washing over me. It can only mean one thing. I'm on my way to becoming a Satori, and that means... More! I need more of them. Oh, I can't just gobble them up one at a time. No, that'll never work. I must collect lots and lots and eat them all at once. And to do that... Oh, guilt and big brother. I have decided to set out on a journey to collect bubble gems. Hmm. I see. Well, it seems you've made up your mind. That being the case, you have my complete support. I hope you collect as many booble gems as you need. Big brother, thank you. Thank you. Traveler, I am grateful for your help. I've decided to set out on a journey to collect booble gems. Next time you get your fingers on a booble gem, please, please give it to me. If you do, I'll trade you a gifty for my collection of treasure for it. And with that, I hope we meet again sometime, somewhere. Hopefully not too soon. Their voice is hard. <sighs> Off he goes. I do hope he's able to make his dream come true. Huh. Now I have to be on my way as well. I'll be making the journey to Terrytown in Akala. Hmm. But dear traveler, thank you so much for helping me, my little brother. And though I hate to impose, I do hope that during your travels you'll find time to assist him further. Ah. I'll keep my ears wide open for news of my brother's whereabouts, so visit me in Terrytown if you need help finding him. Yes, yes, I'll be going now. And I'm off to get another bubble gem. Because you never know. Pico Pond Cave, oh, that's so cute! Ah, <laughs> oh, thanks. <laughs> yeah, right? Lizard. Oh, got him. <laughs> oh, another lizard. More rock salt. Oh, is that ore? Oh, no, maybe not. This mysterious mineral gives off a pale blue glow in the dark, which some believe to be the souls of the dead. Apparently, the stone can be used as a base to make special clothing. Oh, okay. That's it. <clears throat> well, there we go, I guess. Okay, hold on one sec. I'm just gonna have a little bit of shepherd's pie. Because this stuff is yummy. Oh, it's gonna rain again. 
thunderstorm. Oh no. are awesome. <laughs> Should we tell the newspaper what happened here? No, no. Absolutely. We'll tell this whole awful story to the Lucky Clover Gazette and no one else. They'll take it seriously. Mm. Oh, I don't know how we'll get word of this out to them though. The Lucky Clover Gazette is in the Hebra region. They're working out of a stable, I heard. That's all so far west, though. Ah! I think it's. I think we should wait out the storm. Wow! <laughs> but I'm not giving autographs. Ah! Ah! Yeah. <laughs> Yay! I don't know if I want to sell the luminous stone if I can use it to make stuff. Ooh, some of this stuff is worth a pretty penny. I do want to wait out the storm. <gasps> Look at how cute her little outfit is! And all the mushrooms! Mm. Oh, this is quite the outfit you've put together. Although perhaps it could be a little more, uh, coordinated. That is, a complete set would really work for you. What? Sorry, my eye for fashion can't help but see what it sees. I'm forever tempted by the latest styles. The same is true for my boyfriend. The two of us were going to go to Goron City to buy their trendy fire-resistant clothes. Mm. Oh, but we were about to arrive. We got tangled up with some Gorons with strange-looking rocks. I got scared and came back on my own. If you're going to Goron City, then you should be very careful. Oh, what's on the news? A great fairy flees into flower bud. A great fairy, known for her love of music, has hidden herself away in her flower bud. Nearby Woodland Stable. Uh, nearby Woodland Stable is in a panic. Uh, Wait, is this about the great fairy just north of here? When I got here, she was already hidden away inside her flower bud. Troubling. Uh, hmm. This new Lucky Clover Gazette is here for you. Uh, Lucky Clover Gazette has opened its Rito stable. Blah 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 blah. Definitely. Rito village. Mm. Blah blah blah. blah. Uh. Right. It's still thunder. It's still thundering out there. So we just gotta wait. Oh lord, that's quite the quite the. Jeez. All right. Ah. Oh. Right, oh. Well, let's. Oh! I don't have 20 rupees. Oh. Uh. Oh well, I don't. I don't need to sleep. I don't need no sleep. I believe they will. Yeah, <laughs> this is the perfect time for me to eat my uh, 
My shepherd's pie. Hell yeah. Yeah, if you're unlucky enough. Going out, Beetle? His backpack looks like a Heracross. soonish. Progress, do not touch. The proprietor. Probably safe enough now. <clears throat> okay. Well, shit. Now I gotta feel. Now I feel like I gotta pick up all sorts of rocks. I love that horse. Let's bring him back. <clears throat> oh, oh. Yeah, he surprisingly oh. did not get hoofed to the face. Ho oh, oh. ho. This is a very pretty horse. Ho. Oh. Yeah, come on. Ho oh, oh. oh. oh, oh. ho. You're okay, little guy. Ho. Oh. Yeah, I'm gonna keep this guy. Ho oh, oh. ho! He's so pretty! Ha! Oh. Ho oh, oh. oh. ho! Ho oh, ho! Oh. Oh, ho. 
I don't know if I need, like, oh. money to register them, though. Oh, oh. I'm unsure. Oh. Our stable. If you catch a wild horse, bring it here and you can register it. Please visit the inside counter if you want to lodge with us. Mm. Now, how can I help you? Oh. oh. To register, huh? According to our books, you entrusted a horse to us once before. I'll just go ahead and register any horse that you had. I'll come talk to me later if you want to take them out. Now then, once again, you want to register a horse here? It's a pretty horse. Gentle temperament, that's good. Yes. Oh. Free! Ha! Oh. oh, nice! Oh. Point saved up. Get your reward, step up to the couch. Fuck yeah! Alright, alright, alright. Uh, enter a name for your What should we call the horse? Torrent. <laughs> Big question? Yeah. I think Torrent 2 is good. He's the right color. Torrent 2. I like that. Mm. Take. Yeah. Cool. Oh. gear, its saddle, and so forth, or restyle its mane. Mm. Speaking of which, do you know about whistling? If you get separated from your horse, you can whistle and it will come running. Whistle. Got it. But your horse isn't magic. It can't hear you if you're too far away. So do keep that in mind. Oh. Come back again anytime. Wait, I gotta get my uh, thing. Receive reward. Oh. Ah, yes, I'll be right with you. Mm. <laughs> like to get your pony points reward. Oh. Right? Your reward for three points is a towing harness. Hell yeah. Oh. Okay, that's cool. Wagon or an item you'd like to tow somewhere. If you save up two more oh. points, the horse god fabric will be yours. That's a one of a kind item you can bring to the Hateno Village dye shop over in Nikleda. Or Nek Nikluda. We appreciate your patronage. So just like... Oh, okay. Well, cool.